Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. My name is Chime Kankari and today we'll have a little chat about why I love my natural hair. Today I have like a corn roll. Um, this is what I do before I wear my wig. First of all, I would like to ask a few questions. Have you ever been told that you have bad hair, hard hair? Have you ever been told that you have slow growing hair or your hair is not beautiful? Or your hair is just the manageable well i've been told all of that and i believe that for the longest time until i discovered something different and now i have a whole different perspective of my natural hair so back to our topic of today i first went natural in 2013 and um why i went natural is uh, i had a chipped tooth like my tooth was broken and i was called half tooth and i just liked the way i looked in that so in 2013, I got some money from my uncle to um, just for my birthday. So I used the money to repair my tooth, and I felt so I felt better. I felt better about myself and the way I looked after repairing the tooth. So after that, I just asked myself, okay, what is next? What can I do for myself? And um, I had been watching a lot of YouTube videos. Hey YouTube, YouTube videos about natural hair. And I was like, okay, let me just go um, cut my hair. So literally, I woke up the next day and then I just took a scissors, took out the braids I had in my hair and just cut, 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 cut all the relaxed hair I had because my relaxed hair wasn't looking that good. I could show you a picture of my relaxed hair, it wasn't looking that good at all. So I cut it and after I cut my hair, I went to my I went to meet my brothers downstairs and they were like, oh, why did you cut your hair? Like, you don't really look good and all that. I mean, again, brothers, brothers being brothers, right? They had to say what they had to say. Um, but I was like, oh, sure. I mean, it's just something new I want to try. And I could just wear uh, sewing or do some braids and I'll be fine. So I did that. Um, after I cut my hair, I did put on some braids just at least help me in that transition. In my natural hair journey, I've been inspired a lot by a lot of YouTubers, especially Beautiful Brown Baby Dome. She was one of the people who inspired me to first go natural. So in my first year, that's um, still 2013 to 2014, my first year of being natural, I got back from college and went home and my family friends were going for um, a party. So I was just like, okay, I had a braid on then and a friend of mine, Sego, a friend of mine helped me do some braids which are really beautiful. When I came back home, I took them out and just wanted to go for the party. So I just combed up my hair because by then I, my natural hair was had grown to a good length. But I combed up my hair, I was so amazed to see how healthy my hair looked. My hair just looked so full and so beautiful. I was surprised that something that beautiful could come off my scalp. This picture just inspired me to keep going natural. I mean. I hadn't felt this beautiful till I had this like till I took this picture. Like I just felt so beautiful from the inside. I was so amazed by how this hair could grow from my own scalp because I was, I've been told so many negative things about my hair. So after that experience in my first year, seeing just how beautiful I felt in my natural hair, I was motivated to keep going and um, overcome whatever challenge I faced in my natural hair journey. Over the years, I've come to really love my hair and really appreciate the way my hair makes me feel. So I love my hair first, being beautiful. I love my hair for being healthy. My hair for the afro texture and just the fullness. Whenever I comb my hair out, and I mean, when I comb my hair out, I just feel so amazing in my afro texture. I love my hair for the unique feel and just the unique look that it gives to me. I love my hair because it's fine. And when I say fine, I mean like fine, Four, type 4 hair and given that my hair is fine even though it's long I'm still able to um, put it back and style it or even put it back and wear a wig over it and my hair just takes it in well I love my hair because it, it enables me to try out different looks braids, wigs and all different looks it just takes it in well and still keeps itself healthy I love my natural hair for the confidence it brings to me I just love the way I look when I have my hair out or like in a really nice style. I just love the way I feel with my hair looking all nice and well taken care of. And last but not least, I love my hair because it made me famous. Um, I'll show you a video later on how my natural hair made me famous. Well, you take care and I hope you all find ways to love your hair and also 
motivation that will help you through the hard times in your natural hair journey. Thanks for watching and if you like this, please like, share and subscribe.